Welcome to Work Study Information for Supervisors. So how do you get a work study? If this is a new work study position, you'll contact the financial aid office and they will give you a form to request a work study position. If the position already exists, just email the financial aid office and let them know you would like a work study. This is an example of the form that you will get for requesting a work study position. So what's next? When students fill out their FAFSA, they can say if they are interested in work study. When their aid is packaged, if money is available, they will be awarded work study money. If all the money has been awarded, students can be put on a wait list. As students inquire about work study positions in the financial aid office, we can direct them to you. Remember, this is a job, just like any job. So you can interview multiple students, then choose the one you feel fits your needs the best. Then all you need to do is email the financial aid office to let them know who you would like to hire. Tell the student you have chosen to come to the financial aid office to get the referral form. This is an example of the work study referral form. A student cannot go to work until this form has been signed by the student, the work study supervisor, and returned to the financial aid office. Please do not promise a student that they can be your work study. The financial aid office gets money from the federal and state governments. State work study money can only be used for Colorado residents. 30% of the money can be spent on non-need based students. Federal work study money is used for non-resident students. All students receiving federal work study money must be need based. Sometimes, due to their financial situation, a student cannot be awarded work study money. If you have specific needs and find a student that meets those needs, please check with the financial aid office to see if that student could be awarded money before you promise the student anything. A few things to remember. Work studies can never work more than 20 hours in a week. Work study time is submitted every two weeks. We do not pay students to just hang out. If you do not have work for them, tell them they are not needed that day. Make sure you have trained your work study. Make sure your work study is supervised. If a work study has earned all of their allocation for the year, you will be notified to have them stop working. And if a work study is not working out for you, you can release them. We request that you speak with them and then notify the financial aid office. So how do you approve their time? Every two weeks, the work study will submit their time online through Crossroads. Payroll will have explained to them how to do this after they have completed the employee paperwork. After the student has submitted their time, the supervisor will log into Crossroads, click Employee on the left, then scroll down until you see Time Reporting Approval. You should see your work study. Click their name, verify their hours, and approve their time. If you forget on Friday, you will receive an email from payroll on Monday reminding you to approve. If you do not approve their time, your work study will not get paid that pay period. This is an example of the time reporting approval section in Crossroads. If you have any questions, feel free to contact Mary Byers at mary.byers at cncc.edu or Jessica Woolman at jessica.woolman at cncc.edu. Thank you.